What's good y'all, it's your boy Ross back at again with another video. So, I was able to check out some clips from NXT. It's been a minute since I've checked out some NXT clips, but Edge took a visit to NXT, man. This was this was pretty dope to me, putting some, some I guess, some shine into the NXT scene. It definitely does need it. And he uh, confronted Finn Balor, man. He confronted Finn Balor and Pete Dunne. They will be going at it for the NXT championship. Um I, I think this is this is dope. It's it's once again WWE making a smart decision, it's a rarity, of actually making it viable that the Royal Rumble winner could potentially go for the NXT championship. And I like Edge promo between uh when he was in the ring between the two guys and he he basically was putting over the other, he was putting over Finn Balor and Pete Dunne, which I thought was dope, and putting himself over. That's that's how you do it. You know, he's putting them over as some of the best in the business, best to ever do it. And, you know, he's been a big fan of NXT. And he's like, yo, it doesn't matter who wins, man. I just want to see this match. And depending on how this match goes and how good it is, I may make my decision because I've never had the NXT championship. And he's never had it. And I like this. This this reminds me of what Charlotte Flair did when she um, won the Royal Rumble. And she didn't go for the Raw Championship. She didn't go for the SmackDown Championship. She went for the NXT Women's Championship. Uh, I think Rhea Ripley was the champion at the time. And I thought that was dope to put some more spotlight onto NXT. NXT is now, honestly, the third brand. It was, you know, for... I want to say for a few years it was you know coined as the developmental brand that's where people would develop their skills to get ready for the main roster but honestly nxt is like another brand of wwe kind of if you guys remember where it was raw smackdown and then it was ecw this is basically what that is you know what i'm saying is raw smackdown and nxt nxt is his, its own brand but it's under the wwe umbrella and i'm not gonna lie to you man in my opinion it's one of the, it's it's one of the better brands of course it has and quality went down you know it, it, it's not as good as, as it used to be but it still leagues better than monday night raw and a lot of times it's better than SmackDown. The only thing that saves SmackDown, in my opinion now, is Roman Reigns. So, but NXT is still still a top-tier brand, top-tier wrestling brand. And it was cool that Edge went out there and basically said, Yo, hey, I'm, I'm going to keep it a stack with you. I'm I'm the Royal Rumble winner. So, I could go for the, the SmackDown. I can go for the Universal Championship. I can go for the WWE Championship. Or I can go for the NXT title. A title I've never had. And that would be cool. Now, do I think he's going to go for the title? No. I do not think Edge is going to cash in his Royal Rumble win to get the NXT title. But it puts that thought out there. I think that's pretty cool. Now, this also sets up many possible matches. You know what I'm saying? You never know. You could possibly see maybe Edge having a match in NXT. I think that would be pretty cool. Um, there was also another little segment where he's leaving uh, the uh, the performance center and whatnot, uh, well, leaving the area and Karrion Cross confronts him or whatnot, lets him know, like, you know what I'm saying? It may not even be Finn Balor. It may not even be Pete Dunne that you face. It may be me. I'm trying to get a title I never lost, you know, because Karrion Cross, he never lost that title. He had to relinquish it. And it's funny because Edge is in the same situation. He's trying to regain some, regain a title. He ultimately never lost. Once again, it was the World Heavyweight Championship. But in the sense of regaining a, a major title that he never lost due to injury. And I like the aggressiveness the carrying cross had. And Edge was like, yo, bro, I, I see where you're coming from. But, you know what I'm saying? This is the type of stuff that, you know, I live for. You know, I, I like that little quick interaction. I think that was pretty cool. Um, but I don't think he's going for the NXT Championship. Now. I am definitely looking forward to tomorrow because I, I feel like he's just making his rounds around Raw, SmackDown, and NXT. He's going to be visiting SmackDown. Roman Reigns is going to be talking his trash like, I got the job done. I put Kevin Owens away. And that's when Edge is going to come out there. And I think this is going to be 
I, I'm willing to bet this is going to be entertaining as hell. Just to let Roman know, hey, bro, it's cool. You, you, you're the big dog down. You, you're running things. You're the head of the table. That's cool. But I am the Royal Rumble winner. And honestly, I've never had this championship either. And who's to say I don't take yours? Like, I, I can't wait to see their interaction, man. This has been the topic of discussion for WWE. Who is Edge going to face at WrestleMania? And that's good. That is always good. They're not giving it away just yet. Keep feeding this this theory. Keep keep this this notion going of who he's going to face. I like this. This It makes it the show's a little bit intriguing. It makes you want to watch just to see oh is he gonna face this person at wrestlemania he's gonna face this person at wrestlemania like it's good so i'm all for what wwe is doing here man but comment down below let me know um do you think you know what i'm saying would you be excited for edge going for the nxt championship would y'all actually if he chose the nxt champion over um whoever the champion may be over Drew McIntyre over Roman Reigns. Would you guys still be as interested? I want to know. Because honestly, I I still would be interested. I'm not going to lie to you. I think it would be something so fresh. Something left field that no one would have ever thought about. I think that would be pretty cool. Just to give that NXT brand the extra push that it needs. Because it needs it. You know what I'm saying? So comment down below. Let me know. If you guys would be interested in him going for the NXT title. So, but I appreciate all the love and support. Road to 40K. Appreciate y'all kicking it with me. And I'll see y'all on the next one. Peace.